All right, y'all. This is how I like to clean a route. It's not by the book, but it's how I like to clean clean a route. So, stay tuned. Okay, I'm gonna suck up a little bit. Okay, so I like to take two quick draws. Yeah, face them opposite ways. I'm gonna hook in to my belay loop here. My belay loop there. Okay, so now I'm indirect. All right, Scotty, you're good. Make sure to communicate with your belayer. And now you're gonna pull up just a couple feet of slack and tie it off onto your harness. Get tight, tight. And then what I'm gonna do is I gotta untie this knot. So I gotta get my gear back somehow. And it's okay for me to untie this knot because I'm indirect. Sometimes your tail end can get pinched in between your two hard points and your belay loop. And what I like to do is just barely let off pressure on it. So then you can pull it through. That looked like a pretzel. Okay. So now remove the rope from your gear. And then you're gonna take this end, and I like to go through this way. Other people like to go through other ways. I don't really care. Okay. Arm's length, plus your chest. Twist, twist. Grab, bunny through the hole, pull, should be an eight. Now you're gonna take your tail, go through both these little hard points. And all you're gonna do is follow that rope back through and you wanna stay on the outside of it. Now, since there's nobody else up here, you can't do the buddy check, but you can check your figure eight by counting how many lines you see. And the number you're looking for is 10. So for instance, I'm on two hard points. This is two, four, six, eight, 10. That's a good figure eight. So now that I'm on there, I'm gonna communicate with my belayer to take all this slack out so then I'll be tensioned on the rope and not my quick draws. So then I can take my quick draws out. All right, Scotty, you're good. All right. One more draw. Okay, that's good to go. All right, y'all, that looks good. All right, Scotty, we're good to lower. Now, as we go down, we're gonna take these quick draws out. So then we get all our gear back and we didn't lose any money. Thank you. Alrighty. Yeah, go ahead and stop right here. 
Okay, so when you take this last one out, you just want to be careful because you see how there's bend in it. Now when I release that tension, it's going to fling forward, which ultimately is going to make me fall down. So what I like to do is communicate with my belayer and ask them to move just a little bit closer. Hey Scotty, do you mind moving a little bit closer? Good. So then, when I release it, there's not a bunch of tension, I don't fall, my belayer doesn't fall, and everybody's good. Alright buddy, you're good to dirt me. Now that, ladies and gentlemen, is a clean route.